we have lost the war on drugs. We lost the war on drugs a long time ago. Uh, you're fighting against human nature. You're fighting against the laws of supply and demand. The best thing we could do is legalize these drugs and, and account for, well, let's put it this way. We have options in our country. We have policy options. And we're geniuses at regulating things, OK? We could either have the government regulate drugs and collect taxes on those that would, you know, do a lot to, to mitigate any kind of social harms caused. We could also look to the free market to do the same thing, collect the taxes, have that money redistributed into prevention and, and treatment efforts. Or we could have a criminal black market with a bunch of thugs that are involved in other things, too. Remember, these people might be trafficking in humans. You know, they might be trafficking in guns. We are giving them about $400 billion a year in, in gross, you know, dollars. I mean, this is about 8% of international trade, I'll have you. You know, that's larger than the textile industry. It's, it's incredible to think that such a large market is, goes completely unregulated in our country to our own detriment. Drugs come into this country and it's like alchemy at our borders. You know, the price of cocaine increases 50 times as soon as it crosses this magical line into our country.